Welcome to chapter 10, the final chapter of the game. This is Dead City. We are going to go after eight diaries and two postcards for a total of 10 collectibles. Now, our first one is going to be right after your first encounter. You're going to, well, you're going to turn on your flashlight because it's dark, but you're going to squeeze through that little opening there, have this encounter, and then you're going to go into this office over here. You have to go through here as part of the story, but you're going to go in here. It's going to be right between two green filing cabinets. Or blue, I'm not sure what color that is. But go ahead and pick that up. That is, again, the first of two postcards in this chapter. Next up, we're going to go through some water. And then we're going to climb out up this little ramp to an area where you can see a whole bunch of corpses. You're going to see them on the ground and cages above you. So go up this little ramp and then swing around behind you. And you'll find it on the corner of the desk. So a little bit later on, you're going to go up an escalator that no longer works. Well, of course, nothing works in this world, but we're going to turn left. We're going to open up this door and we're going to go through three rooms. One, two, and in the third room is going to be a diary on the left hand side in the middle. Okay, so let's head to Kirill's little hideout here. We're going to find two collectibles in here. As soon as you enter, go straight back to this board with a bunch of maps on it. Within that cluster is going to be a diary called Orders. You want to pick that up and then stay in this room because our final postcard is here. So turn around really slow. You don't want to turn around too fast. On that column right in the center of the room is the final postcard. Of course, you'll get a trophy for completing all of the postcards and all of the diaries. So two uh, trophies for that. All right, so next up, we got another diary. This is going to be kind of in a underground city. Pretty heavily, uh, pretty heavily dense area here. And so we're just going to follow the path the way you're supposed to go. And you're going to go into a train car. You're going to find this on the right hand side as you enter on the seat over here. All right, so next up, you got a bit of rowing we're going to do. And it's not long after you start, you're going to see an opening here on the left hand side. You want to go inside of here. I didn't kill everything first, probably should have, but we're going to go straight to the back and we're going to circle around to the left to enter a locked room. In order to enter this room, you're going to have to climb up this little ramp. The ramp's right in front of us, so we're going to go through this hole in the wall and you'll find the diary on the left hand side. All right, so much later on, after all of the rowing bit, after your first vision, you're going to go up again, another broken escalator, and I'm going to swing around to the left. Probably going to the right would have been faster in retrospect. Anyways, we're going to go down this hall, and we're going to find a room to the left-hand side. Momentarily, there it is. Oh, the door is open. I don't remember if I opened it or not. But in this office, this is a small office, we're going to find uh, a bunch of things. One of which is the brown note. There it is. All right, so later on, we're going to be outside. We're going to have a vision of a tank, and then you're going to drop down. Instead of going straight, you want to turn around and go back the way you came, but underground this time. So when you drop down there, you'll see a monster out in the distance. Immediately turn around and head backwards. So the final collectible in the game, after your little vision of the gas mask attaching onto Anna there, we're going to drop into a new building. And for some reason, I decided to do a little sightseeing here. I'm not entirely sure why. All right, so inside this new building, we're going to find a set of stairs on the right-hand side. This is part of the story path. We're going to go down these stairs. We're going to open a door. And the final diary in the game is going to be right in front of us. I'm not going to pop the trophy because I did these out of order. But there it is. I want to thank you for watching. If you found these guys helpful, it would mean a lot to me if you guys can hit the like button. It would help support the channel. And, of course, subscribe.